on the nation's railroads. First, it was the steam engine that vanished from the nation's rails. Now, 40 years later, another sentimental favorite is fading fast. Green Country reporter Miles Saunders and photographer Grant Girondale travel with a Tulsa folk singer who has composed a farewell. <laughs> If you've had to wait for a train to pass any time lately, you may have noticed something is missing. Trains, kind of like movies, don't seem to end the same way they used to. What's missing is the caboose. Okay, Larry, you got 80 pounds back here, set them up. After over 100 years in the service of America's railroads, the caboose is going the way of the dinosaur. Its replacement, a simple box called a freight rear-end device. Fred for short. This is what replaced the caboose then, right? That's it. That's little Fred. Like so many others, Tulsa folk singer Pat Richardson was always intrigued by the caboose. And now, with the caboose about to fade into history, he's composed a farewell. We talked with him on the only railroad we could find that would let us take one last ride. The Arkansas and Missouri, just over the Oklahoma line. As we weaved our way through the countryside, we listened to the sound that has inspired musicians for more than a century. It's a train rhythm as it goes. Hear that? Hear the clingy clack? And that's how the rhythm starts, and that's how that's how a song comes to your mind. You you feel it. You kind of feel it first, and then then the words come to you, and then pretty soon you're you start playing it, and then people listen to it go play the train song, play the train song. It captured the fancy of a young boys and men. America gave it its name. It rocked and its way to a rhythm so soft. The car at the end of the train. They'd wave at us all in passing so swiftly. The men there who garnered the fame. The heroes of stories and legends so tall. The men at the end of the train. But the times they are changing, the crummy old weight car was fine. Now a long, lonely freight, no caboose at its end, so they moves toward the end of the line. The caboose was always special. Locomotives are just machines. Boxcars carry cargo. But a caboose carried somewhere inside a human soul. Someone who, if waved at, would always wave back. All things must pass, and it's sad that they do. A phone call was once just a dime. Now cabooses are pictures in someone's old books. I'd settle for simpler times. A minstrel now comes to the twin streaks of rust to see if a red car remains. And just for a moment his spirit is touched. He's a man at the end of the train. He's a man at the end of the train. Miles Saunders, Channel 6 News. Sad to see that tradition come to an end. Yes, it is, in a way. Well, that's the news for this Thursday, August 4th. Thank you for sharing your time. Good night.